I'm Ed Hyland here in Houston, where the latest energy technology and innovation is on display. This is the Offshore Technology Conference 2024. Energy professionals from around the world are here at OTC, sharing new ideas, forging new partnerships, and exploring new solutions. Whether it's oil and gas, carbon capture, wind, or hydrogen, OTC is four days centered around offshore technology and the global energy evolution. It's not simple, but it's solvable. We gotta get out of this binary, good and bad, clean and dirty narrative which is pitting people against each other in a very divisive way and recognize that no, these things are all needed and they're all important. Let's start working them together. Monday marked the start of the highly anticipated OTC keynote speaker series. Renowned speakers from around the world discussing the pressing topics facing the industry and the revolutionary technologies that will shape our future. What I really find intriguing this morning was the different topics here just coming out from the talk at HPHT. The other talk I attended was about wind offshore. I mentioned geothermal. So it's all these different topics, which I'm sure they can foster each other, learn from each other in an offshore conference. So again, that's gonna be quite impressive. Monday also kicked off the OTC technical program with several sessions and panels for attendees to take in. Those in the audience learning about the solutions needed to provide the world's energy while also creating a cleaner and more sustainable future. I really enjoyed it, and it's just the first day, so uh, we need many topics to learn and people to meet. It's like a new student in the university, right? Meeting new people, learning a lot, exchanging experiences, all right? Another highly anticipated session, the Executive Dialogue Series, with a Monday presentation by Latin America's largest oil and gas producer, Petrobras, focusing on how to produce low carbon oil. We need to decarbonize our operations as, as much as we can, and that will also require public policies. We want, we cannot give up from uh, dialoguing with our governments because of that. We are not king oil anymore. We need to compose with other sources, including for liquid energy, in which we are still dominating and will still dominate for at least four decades ahead. We need to prepare ourselves to be energy companies all together. The energy transition presentations were also a hit with OTC attendees, including a Monday session demonstrating the benefits of using electrifying rigs. It's, it's something that, that you get at the show that that's, you know, you can't experience elsewhere, of course, with the face-to-face -face, as well to have the uh, meet and greet and, and meet all the new, new clients, new customers. This year at OTC, there are thousands of energy professionals here in Houston, and that includes more than 1,300 exhibitors. You can almost see the energy excitement everywhere you look. OTC is the one with the biggest energy conferences in the world. Every year I attract a lot of expert industry uh, company come here. I see it's a great platform for, for us communicate the technology, policy, education, uh, share all the great ideas. What I really like about OTC, it's both the exhibition floor, you can meet a lot of companies, customers, and you have the technical program, uh, like in parallel, so you can have a full schedule where you have best of both. What I'm here to accomplish is to just to see the various exhibitions, the companies, what they have to offer, what's new, you know, the challenges that we're facing, and then the approaches on how they're going to deal with it. When we say that OTC is a global event, we mean it. Look no further than the OTC Around the World series, where speakers from different parts of the world give talks about the energy opportunities and challenges in their homeland, giving attendees a new perspective. There's so many interesting things happening within the industry these days, so this is a great place to meet uh, companies and persons from all over the world. OTC is also taking time to recognize the cutting-edge innovators in the offshore technology sector. The Spotlight on New Technology Award is given to OTC exhibitors who are reshaping the industry through their innovative and developmental technologies. First of all, those two awards are very unique because they are showcasing how the industry is evolving. Um, we're going autonomous, robotic, and that really means that we can do um, the activity in this energy space in a safer, but also a sustainable way. 
you need to keep advancing in our industry, right? Find efficiencies, uh, reduce risk. So, you know, being able to bring a technology here and put it on display and being acknowledged for it, I mean, that, that means a lot to us. I think it's going to be uh, gratifying for the teams to see us, uh, you know, receive the award, which is a uh, significant accomplishment. This year, 15 technologies were selected for their demonstrated advancements in the industry, five of them from small business. We've touched on so much here at OTC, yet we're just getting started. There are still three more days to see all there is to offer here in Houston. From day one of OTC 2024, I'm at Highland.